We're at Helical Technology. These guys are world leaders in exhaust valve actuators and rotators. We're here to find out about their latest acquisition and how it's massively improved production. But first of all, a little lesson about what a rotator actually is. So my name is Johan Buston. I'm the global sales manager for Helical Technology Limited. Uh, we supply, design and manufacture valve rotators on a global scale to the engine OEs. Uh, a valve rotator, in essence, sits on top of the valve. Okay? On each impulse, it will rotate. Okay? It stops carbon buildup, helps with emissions, uh, reducing the emissions, um, and it increases the, the life of the valve train. We supply circa 4 million valve rotators to our customers around the world. Um, and this is the, the valve rotator in question. Um, actually is, is one of our key accounts that we supply I to. Mean, what we do see, like I've already said, is the stability of these machines and the performance we get from them is far superior to some of the other machines that we currently have. Yeah, the interface on the machines, when the guys are using it, it's actually really intuitive for the guys. It's touchscreen, which is quite a good idea for the machines. Um, what tends to happen as well, if there's any issues with the machine, if it alarms out, it will generally come up with pictorial displays on how to recover the machine. So rather than having to dig into a manual, losing time, you know, it's a lot quicker to recover a machine. It helps with uptime as well. It's really user-friendly. Uh, when it comes to programming, it can be programmed on the machine with the software that's within it, or it can also be programmed offline as well. What we tend to find is that spending a bit more money on a machine like this, you get better quality of product. The machine lasts us a lot longer. So by getting better quality of product, we're producing less, less scrap internally. It's a triple turret, uh, twin spindle. Um, so obviously with the machining that we're doing, we're doing a, a balanced roughing because it's got two of the actual heads on the first side. So we're doing a balanced roughing which gives us a large reduction in cycle time. Um, and with having the, the actual three turrets, we can be cutting three different features at the same time. The previous machine that this replaced uh, was manufacturing these in four minutes. Uh, but with the new Nakamura, we're actually generating these parts in two and a half minutes. What we used to do, we used to have to manufacture on several machines. Uh, but this allows us to manufacture on far less now.